And Erica, that's right. My unicorn horn pointed me right in the direction of Salem. This is the place to be on Halloween. I have been attacked by Frankenstein, scared more times than I can count between the haunted house and the monster museum. But I brewed up a special potion to bring you all right into the action. Oh, Halloween, the day is here, calling all ghouls, ghosts, and goblins well, happy Halloween. from far and near. San Antonio, Antonio Texas. Texas. California. I am from Cincinnati, Ohio. Um, I came because I love Halloween. A little hocus pocus and some magic to spare, cast a spell, and well, there's something creepy in the air. I like to scare children. <laughs> Now wasn't that pretty neat? Halloween in Salem just can't be beat. You gotta do it once. You just have to do it once in your life. It's like full of spirit here and like anywhere, there, anywhere else you wouldn't like find it. The energy is insane here. Uh, you pick up on it, you get excited. Witches taking off, they're flying high. Beware, zombies, vampires, and werewolves, oh my. Costumes galore all up and down the street. Get ready to be spooked by anyone you meet. Scary clowns I'm afraid of. Happy Halloween to you from Salem, Massachusetts. Boo. <laughs> Boo is right, and there is so much going on here. Hopefully my little poetic potion there made up for my lazy costume because I have been amazed by the creativity of the costumes here. They are out of this world, and the fun isn't over yet. The day's festivities will be capped off tonight with a fireworks display over the North River at 10.15 p.m. 